Hi guys, just wanted to do a quick unboxing of uh, something I just received yesterday. Um, it's the Logitech Squeeze Box Touch, which a lot of uh, you audiophile uh, guys have been talking about. Um, lots of good reviews, um, and I uh, just wanted to try it out, connect it to my hi fi system, and see how the sounds like. Right. Okay, so let's take a quick look at the box. Basically, um, it's uh, quite a big box, right? Um, for for the size of the gadget, I suppose. This is the front of the box. Um, so basically, what this device does is it actually plays music from, let's say, your PC or a hard disk, a NAS, um, um, and you know, goes through the squeeze box device via Wi-Fi, right, and then uh, plays the music um, through your hi-fi system, uh, your amplifier, and, and to, through your speakers, right. Um, the way that you actually can uh, pick the songs that you want to play, um, you can actually either use the touchscreen interface of the device itself, or you could use the, um, the smartphone app, like from iPhone, you, you have an app that allows you to control the device, what, what songs you want to play from your PC or hard, hard disk, right? Comes with a remote control as well. Okay, so let's take a look at the side of the box. Um, nothing much here, it's all in multiple languages. Don't really understand It's what it's saying. It's made in China, right? So this side uh, has a couple of pictures showing you um, the application, I mean, the, how the application looks like on the device. Um, shows you it's a touch-enabled device. Um, you know, some other pictures down here. I've, there's also a picture here of um, someone inserting uh, like a, what looks like an SD card into the squeeze box. So I suppose it supports that. Um, Okay, so some some marketing material here. Basically, it's full color, 4.3 inch color touchscreen. Fill the house with music, blah blah. Right. Um, nothing much on this side of the box. Okay. Technical specs on the bottom of the box. Basically, it, it plays um, MP3. Flag, Wave, AIFF, WMA, AAC, Apple Lossless, and more. So um, most of the music that I have on my hard disk is actually in Apple Lossless format, so that's great. Um, wireless Ethernet interface, um, support for 802.11b, G, and N routers, uh, and access points, as well as like a straight cable connection through the Ethernet port that's available. Uh, has all the encryption modes as well, WPA, WEP, and so on. Uh, USB host connector, so basically you can access music through the USB drive, uh, through the USB port that this device has, or even using a USB thumb drive. Uh, it has the SD card slot and at the back you have RCA uh, ports, headphone jack, um, optical, uh, coax output. Um, so what the box comes with, comes with the player, comes with a power supply, um, remote control, then user documentation. And, it, and the product comes with a two-year manufacturer's uh, guarantee. right? Okay, so on this side of the box, it tells you what type of specs your PC has to have in order to support, I guess, the software that comes with the device. You need Mac OS X 10.3 or later, so, um, Pentium uh, 256 Mac RAM, broadband, broadband internet connection, stereo system, and so on. Okay, so I'm going to crack this, this device open. So today I'm going to use my 
let them in um, to open it. So I think we have another box inside of it that's black in color. Kind of a box within a box. Okay, so comes with a cover, remote control, kind of light, right? Like a cheap plastic remote control. And this is the squeeze box itself, um, which we'll take a look at it later. Let me see what the rest of the box has. So basically you have um, just a plastic container here, nothing there. And you have a user guide, a quick start guide, um, piece of kind of a microfiber cloth to, to wipe the screen, I guess. Right. Um, power cord and adapter. Let me open this up. So it comes with a little adapter here for I think US a uh, European style plugs, uh, RCA cables, um, Duracell batteries like triple A's. And the power cord itself, the and let's take a look here. So, not sure whether you can see it. Uh, trying to zoom in for you. Basically, it's a universal power plug, which is good. Basically, it supports uh, 100 to 240 volts, right? So you can use this anywhere in the world, right? Just to let you guys know, I actually bought this from Amazon in the U.S. So great that I can buy something from the US and have it work uh, where I stay right okay as for the rest of the box it's empty right so let's take a look at the device itself right so um, like I said the front just has a picture down here right at the back um, it has a it has like a stand here pretty sturdy stand with a rubber um, kind of um, feet so you can actually rest this device on let's say something else like a table and amp um, some some specs down here serial number um, and all and all that so it comes with a headphone out um, RCA out uh, digital I think this, this should be digital out as well um, I think this is coax um, Ethernet prob Ethernet in USB in and of course this is the jack for the um, AC adapter right so it's it's quite a well-built device not doesn't it's quite heavy right it's not plasticky or anything like that um, there's also a little pot down here, I guess, for ventilation. There's also a little button down here. I'm not sure what this is. I have to read the manual to figure it out. Looks like a reset button of some sort. Okay, so I think um, that kind of wraps up my review, right? So this is the Logitech squeeze box. Um, I'll give some comments after I set this up um, with my NAS, which is coming in as well from Amazon, and I'll let you guys know um, how it works. Thanks, and thanks for watching, and uh, have a good day.